Adana family says they want justice for their son. The family says Adana Police Department could have prevented him from taking his own life. CBS 4's Annalise Ortiz reports. Every day, the Garza family can catch a glimpse of this mural of their son, brother, and cousin. We were very, very close. But they're also left with the reminder that Jose Luis Garza is gone. This incident really took a toll on our family. Jose struggled with alcoholism and drug addiction. Oftentimes, his family would ask the Donna Police Department to take him into custody so that he wouldn't pose a threat to others or himself. That was the case on February 19th of this year. Mr. Gata's family desired that the Donna Police Department merely hold Mr. Gata until he had sobered up and then release him as they had done on prior occasions. But Garza wasn't released. He took his own life while inside of his jail cell. In a federal lawsuit, the family claims that the police department was negligent. Garza was able to successfully cover the camera in his jail cell. The lawsuit claims that the officer responsible for watching those video monitors should have checked up on him at that point. What we are seeing thus far uh, indicates that the protective custody supplied by the Donna Police Department fell far short. The Garza family is hoping that the lawsuit will bring them peace as they continue to heal from their loss. As time has passed by, it is still difficult, but slowly, you know, we're all coping. Reporting in Donna, Annalise Ortiz, CBS 4 News and ValleyCentral.com. An attorney for the city of Donna declined to comment on this pending litigation.